features of American neighborhoods is that the American urban landscape is restless. It's always changing. Boyle Heights fits into that story right at its heart. You can read histories of the United States from this place. Anyone that comes from Boyle Heights, if you talk to somebody that was born and raised in, in Boyle Heights, like myself, we say that with a great deal of pride. I, I never knew any, <laughs> any, any other things, you know, but just Boyle Heights. It was a very diverse community. I think it was a progenitor in many ways of what the city was gonna be like. LA is the, the most diverse city in the United States. We come from 140 countries, we speak 200 languages, and Boyle Heights has always been an entry point. My neighbors were like the Muramotos, the Focuccis, the Gabrielinis, the Robocas, the Volkovs. The media has focused mostly on, you know, the five o'clock news, like, oh, shooting this, shooting that. Look at what's happening now to Boyle Heights. The story is not over. It, it kind of stands for what, what we could become if we stood against forgetting that we belong to each other. There's a hero in Boyle Heights. I seen this guy, you know, I, I was with his sister and we grew up together. They helped me. They took care of me when I didn't have anything. And we, had, we got an award for Where's the Love, a Grammy Award. And we were living right here next to the laundromat, right across the street from Roosevelt. I was living right there with the Grammy Award. <laughs> people didn't know that. And my line, Enrique, he was like, no, hey, Willie, it's kind of crazy. You got a Grammy and people don't even know you're in the back of the laundry man. <laughs> <laughs> Boa Heights hasn't really gotten its place in history the way Ellis Island or other places, the roles other neighborhoods played throughout the United States. So the more we search into history, we're going to find that uh, Boa Heights has played a very significant role in the past of the United States and will in the future because this is a place where you could come and find every urban issue and study it and it's here.